Welcome to our YouTube video on the remarkable life of Admiral Yi Sun Sin. Yi Sun Sin is revered as one of the greatest naval commanders in history. Known for his unwavering loyalty, strategic brilliance, and indomitable spirit, he left an enduring legacy that continues to inspire generations. Birth and Youth, Yi Sun Sin, one of Korea's most celebrated figures, was born in 1545 in the coastal city of Seoul. From a young age, he displayed exceptional intelligence, determination, and a deep love for his country. Although his family was of noble background, they faced financial hardships, which motivated Yi Sun Sin to work diligently to overcome adversity. During his youth, Yi Sun Sin received a well rounded education, studying Confucian classics, military strategy, and the art of warfare. His passion for the sea and naval affairs grew as he spent his formative years in a coastal region, developing a keen understanding of maritime activities. This early exposure to the naval world shaped Yi Sun Sin's destiny, as he would later become a naval commander of extraordinary skill and courage. His youth provided him with a strong foundation, instilling in him the values of loyalty, discipline, and a deep sense of duty to his nation. The experiences and lessons of Yi Sun Sin's youth would serve as a launching pad for his remarkable career, ultimately propelling him to become a legendary figure in Korean history. The Injun War, Yi Sun Sin's most renowned contribution to Korean history came during the Japanese invasion of Korea in the late 16th century, known as the Injun War, from 1592 to 1598. As a naval commander, Yi Sun Sin played a pivotal role in defending Korea against the formidable Japanese forces. Appointed as the supreme commander of the Korean Navy, Yi Sun Sin implemented innovative tactics and revolutionized naval warfare. He designed and built a new type of battleship called the Turtle Ship, which featured a covered deck with iron spikes and cannons, providing superior protection and firepower. This invention proved instrumental in several crucial battles. Yi Sun Sin's strategic brilliance and unwavering commitment to defending his homeland led to a series of remarkable victories against the Japanese Navy. Despite being outnumbered and facing significant obstacles, he demonstrated exceptional leadership, inspiring his troops to fight with unwavering courage and determination. Appointed as the supreme commander of the Korean Navy, Yi Sun Sin implemented innovative tactics and revolutionized naval warfare. He designed and built a new type of battleship called the Turtle Ship, which featured a covered deck with iron spikes and cannons, providing superior protection and firepower. This invention proved instrumental in several crucial battles, Yi Sun Sin's strategic brilliance and unwavering commitment to defending his homeland led to a series of remarkable victories against the Japanese Navy. Despite being outnumbered and facing significant obstacles, he demonstrated exceptional leadership, inspiring his troops to fight with unwavering courage and determination. Yi Sun Sin's legacy as a national hero and his significant contributions to the defense of Korea during the Japanese invasion continue to be celebrated in Korea to this day. His Last Years and Death Yi Sun Sin's death marked the end of an era and a profound loss for Korea. On December 16, 1598, Yi Sun Sin met his tragic fate during the Battle of Noryang, the final naval engagement of the Japanese invasion of Korea. During the battle, Yi Sun Sin's flagship, the Geobuxian, turtle ship, was struck by a Japanese bullet that penetrated his helmet and caused a severe head injury. Despite his grievous wound, Yi Sun Sin continued to inspire and lead his troops, refusing to abandon his post. However, his condition deteriorated rapidly, and he succumbed to his injuries the following day, on December 17, 1598, at the age of 53. His death was a profound loss for the Korean nation, as he was not only a brilliant military strategist but also a symbol of resilience, patriotism, and unwavering dedication to defending his homeland. Yi Sun Sin's death left a void in the Korean military, but his legacy and contributions have endured throughout history. His strategic genius, innovative naval tactics, and indomitable spirit continue to inspire generations of Koreans and serve as a testament to the unwavering commitment to national defense. Although Yi Sun Sin's physical presence may have been lost, his memory and legacy live on as a symbol of courage, sacrifice, and patriotism.
His remarkable achievements in defending Korea against the Japanese invasion and his unwavering determination have made him a national hero and a revered figure in Korean history. And thus, we come to the end of this journey through the extraordinary life of Admiral Lee Sun Sin. His unwavering dedication, unmatched naval prowess, and unwavering commitment to defending his homeland have left an indelible mark on history. <laughs>